Alright everyone, this video is about recording fuel pressure uh, using a Gen 3 computer on an LS uh, and using HP tuners to do so. Um, so what you need to do is you need to go on Amazon or eBay or whatever and get yourself a pressure transducer here uh, so you can put it in your fuel rail. I'm running an aftermarket fuel rail system. I'm going to go ahead and put it right there in my return. As you can see, I'm going to put a manual gauge here on the top of my automotive fuel pressure regulator. Uh, the trick to this is to get yourself a pressure gauge and set yourself up a brass T. These are quarter inch uh, NPT inlets here. And I have an air pressure hose set up to my regulator on my air tank. Uh, the next step would be to wire in your lead to your computer uh, using the tank pressure sensor. Uh, I'll put the pin out down below for you so you can tell exactly where to do it. I just depinned the computer and went ahead and pinned it in right there. Uh, you could go to the trouble of going all the way back to the tank. I'm lazy and took the path of least resistance since those aren't being used on my setup anyhow the next thing you want to do is go ahead and turn your fuel pressure regulator <clears throat> and record your tank pressure voltage here and on the gauge out underneath the hood you want to go ahead and record that and write those down so as you can see here, I've got that 0 0.20 volts. I've got 9 PSI working my way down, so I get a good spread. And at 0.38 volts, I have 97 PSI. Your step after that will be to go ahead and download a spreadsheet. You could probably do the calculation yourself. This one I got from dsxtuning.com you put your voltage in and your pressure that you've recorded uh, pick a low number pick a higher number for the other 0.38 volts equals 97 pounds and that gives you the offset so your value is going to be your voltage from your fuel fuel tank pressure that's v divided by point you know what this is going to be different for you but this is mine so voltage over 0 0.0409 plus a positive number 3.993 next step will be to go in HP tuners you can do a math parameter go ahead and set this up call it something that you'll remember like fuel pressure trial number two and there's your expression so the PID 6420.10 is the fuel tank pressure divided by the value that we showed earlier that goes in parentheses plus 3.99 after that you can go ahead and put it in your scanner which is down below here so we got uh, 28 psi fuel pressure at 1 volt and that way you can go ahead and can you can watch your fuel pressure uh, when you're doing logging a run um, making sure you're not running out of fuel pressure this is specific to the gen 3 engine computers I think I, this one's a P01. Uh, they do not log fuel pressure as a regular PID. I hope that helped you out. Uh, I will go ahead and put some pinouts in there. I'll put a uh, link to the sensor that I bought on the uh, in the description. And we can go ahead and uh, you can build your own. 
Hope you all have a great day, and I hope that helps.